So we have uh, 34 TVs, two big projectors. So we do a lot of live stream and uh, live gaming events. We host a lot of tournaments here and casually people can just come here and play some games, have some drinks and just have fun. We have all the classic old school game, uh, games like uh, GoldenEye, N64, Atari. Um, the regulars who come in here and all the all the interesting people and promoters and and it's just really interesting watching all these people who are super passionate about something that no one's no one really in Canada knows about yet. My name is Daniel. I'm the founder of Raiders. So as much as we we all like gaming, me and my partners, my teammates, we are all huge fans of gamers, and we build this of our, around our esports. But we we don't want to scare people who doesn't play game as much away. We want everybody to come in and have fun, right? Um, that's why we have some of the casual retro stations at that. We have N64 and Atari, old classic one, Mario Kart, uh, GoldenEye. Like even people who are 30 or 40 years old, they can find their memories here and have a drink at the bar. Everybody can fit in here. Um, and everybody can have fun in here. That's the whole idea of um, our this venue. Some other people sits beside it will be to say, hey, you play League of Legends 2 or you play Counter-Strike as well? well? Let's play together. It's, it's different from Cyber Cafe because in Cyber Cafe you would only go there by yourself and you would either play by yourself or just with a friend. You won't talk to the people beside you. You're zoned out by your own place. But in here, like, the, the atmosphere we built, it's, it's for everybody. And especially the events, we make people engage to each other. And, and that's, what's, that's the beauty about this place. And I love to see people making friends in here or talking to each other. So we, we do play other sports as well. Like uh, if Blue Jays makes it to the playoff or uh, hockey season, season starting, if people ask, we, have, we still have the uh, regular tables. We're able to, to turn it on. And uh, it's whatever makes people happy. My name's Liam and I've been working here since we opened in August. The best asset about this bar is, you know, the, the video games are fun and all, all the, the cool tech is a lot of fun, but it's the people. The people who come in here, uh, you know, the staff that work here, they care a lot, uh, the kitchen staff are awesome, um, the regulars who come in here and all the, all the interesting people and promoters and, and it's just really interesting watching all these people who are super passionate about something that no one's, no one really in Canada knows about yet. So it's really, it's the people, you know, it's, they, they bring their passion here, we, sh you know, give it right back to them. The future of Raiders is, is becoming the central esports venue of uh, Toronto or even Canada, where uh, everybody comes here, everybody hear the name Raiders, they know we have a kick-ass venue, we host kick-ass events, and they would all come here either for casual gaming or casual gathering, or just coming here for our crazy events, or meeting the pro players. I picked Raiders beside uh, St. Cure Station because it's sort of in the center of Toronto and it's reachable for everybody and it's right beside uh, a subway station. So it's accessible for everyone to come here. It's easy to commute you can from basically any part of the city.
Thank you guys for coming. It was a pleasure showing you guys around. And for all those who want to check out Raiders, I'll be gladly to show you around.